these hits. Um, definitely going to try and catch you coming out of shield, catch you jumping. She's going to try and stuff out a lot of your approaches with aerials. Uh, two framing of the ledge with forward tilt, that kind of a thing. But we'll see who he's playing today. Kip was been playing, uh, I think he was playing Snake earlier, actually. Um, but now we have Pokemon Trainer and Peach. Pokemon Trainer, definitely looking like one of the best characters in the game right now. Peach has always looked like one of the best characters. Going to get to see these guys square off. This matchup is going to be really common at high level. I um, feel like he's going to have to to get a few hits with Squirtle to get that grab, and then he's going to switch to Ivysaur. Um, oh, that's unfortunate. Kip going to withdraw into the stage. Kip going to withdraw into the stage. I'm going to lose that first stock to an unfortunate SD. Opting to go Charizard immediately. Uh-oh. It was that big combo I was talking about. 57 in one exchange. Kip is going to take for coming out of shield. Kip looking a little lost right now. Oh, will he get the downer? Nope, no downer. Going to grab him. Up B. Up B going to take it to the ledge right there. Nice. Kip is right back in it now. He gets a few hits with this Ivysaur. One grab could put him back to even. Ivysaur does so much damage with those juggles. Okay. Good on Shade. Trying to control the air. Control him coming out of shield. Keeping him from jumping. Okay, Dot Eyes. He still got it. He, he caught it after he hit it. The grab. Up air. Up air. Up air again. Okay. Let's let's dallion down. What's uh, what's Shade gonna do here? Get a lead situation. Back air to back air. We'll catch you coming out of shield every time. We'll kill you at that ledge. Insanely early. All right. Let's see how Kip is gonna try to close out this stock, or if Dallion lands a down tilt. If he lands a down tilt, that down tilt right there. Continuing the combo through the Pokemon switch. Going to catch the Squirtle. Coming into the game. Withdrawal going to catch Shade dashing back there. Dangerous situation. Ooh, forward air on Shield going to get grabbed. Back throw. Let's see how Shade gets on stage. Ooh, Ivysaur down air going to beat that Parasol up B. Great stuff by Kip taking that. Okay, Kip. Being very patient on his recovery. Good stuff. Oh, all he needs is one hit with this portal, one grab, and he can he can put on some major percent here. Down air. Oh man, these guys are just filling each other out. They're slowing down now. They know. They know that this is where this is where it counts. Oh, the withdrawal gonna armor through that forward air. Oh. So much shield pressure. Kip is retreating to, to get his shield back up. Oh, the forward air gonna hit on ledge. That forward air is so big. How will Kip recover? Oh, the turnip. Turnip is gonna take that. Charizard not having armor on those later frames. Kip, instead of opting to side B to the ledge, he decided to go low and up B. Got punished for it. Shade gonna take game one there. Great stuff from both players. These guys really showing that they've played each other before. Um, definitely have a feel for what the other person wants to do. Um, definitely going to give us some some uh, neutral interactions that you probably won't see uh, from people who, who don't play each other very often. Looks like we're on Town and City for Game 2. Going to get right into it. Kip sticking to his Pokemon trainer, not opting to switch. Ooh. No punish on the on the Peach Bomber. But the up throw combos. Oh, the turnip? That could have been huge. Up tilt, up there. Yeah. Kip definitely definitely controlling neutral. After these after these few big hits. Oh man, Kip, that was so smart. Just going out there and landing that down air. Knowing that Shade was going to continue to float. Great stuff by Kit. Taking an early lead. Extending it with these up air combos from Ivysaur. Man, that character is so scary. 
What will Dalian do about this? Keeping him at ledge. Back air. There. Oh, he's, he's got a bomb. The taunt. Oh, the bomb is on the ground. Oh! Shade almost killing himself for back airing the bomb. <laughs> Edge guard situation. Oh, this is a scramble. Oh. These guys playing in and out of each other's range right now. Oh, the up smash. Oh, no punish on the up smash. The forward smash gonna call out the spaghetti spot dodge. Kip is up three stocks to one right now. Here in game two. Man, good stuff on Kip. Lots of scramble situations. That's not what you want against Kip. He is he is good in those little scramble situations where you have to quickly decide what to do. Definitely a player that, that likes to keep his tempo. Oh, the Z drop? No way. He, Kip going to make it back from under the stage. Instead of getting gimped by that Z drop turnip or throw. Dalian is just looking for anything to close the stock out right now. Okay, back air to Rising there, gonna catch Kip coming out of shield. Kip is getting hit by all of those landing back airs on shield to uh, continual aerial pressure. Down throw Nair. Okay. Slowing down a little bit here. Kip getting a double back air. Uh oh, getting put off stage, he doesn't have a jump. Gets one more with Charizard. Good turn up to Nair there, getting Shade back on stage. Shade is just looking to cover his landings here. Gib definitely needs to tighten up if he wants to take this third stock. He has a stock to play with, but that Peach can kill you in one hit if you are not careful. Oh, that back air narrowly missing that air dodge. Okay, another back air. Up tilt. Oh, not catching the landing with a forward tilt there. Ledge situation. And Shade is kind of letting... Letting Kip down for free here. Oh, trying to catch him jumping out of shield. Kip is opting to stay grounded. Oh, landing there. Going to get the late hit, so it's not going to put him off stage. The pivot cancel forward tilt. Going to take that third stock. And take game two. Good stuff from Kip. Uh, Charizard looking unkillable. All right, let's see where we're going for game three. Battlefield. Okay. What are we going to see here? We're going to still see that Pokemon Trainer pick? Looks like it. Pokemon Trainer. Uh oh. Dalian changes his, changes his, uh, his color. We got the, the unforeseen color counter pick. Let's see if this mental power up can do anything for Shade here in game three on Battlefield. Going to get right into it. These platforms are going to be so good for both characters. Mainly thinking about how Squirtle can extend his up air combos, how Ivysaur can extend his up air combos. That kind of pressure is not something you want to be dealing with. Don't know exactly why Shade's taking him here. Oh, that forward air is narrowly going to miss. Down throw, up air, up air. Going to barely miss on that tech end on that platform. Offstage situation. Oh, Kip getting hit, hit by that Z drop turnip. Woo! Great edge guard by Shade there. Great edge guard by Shade. Ready for every option. All right, let's see what kind of extra extra credit Shade can tack on here against this Squirtle. Get up attack, gonna punish that F smash. Yeah, Kip is doing a lot of unsafe pressure now. Definitely needs to slow down and try and take this stock. Gonna try and get the raw F smash on the missed tech, but it's not gonna connect. Oh, Kip. Slipping right now. Losing this stock. Slowly. Definitely looks like Dalian is in control. 
That forward smash gonna beat the Peach Bomber, and up air gonna take it because Shade was DIing in. Man, trying to float back to stage. Excellent job by Kip there. Ooh, narrowly missing that same turnip setup. Okay, we got an air, back air, off stage situation. Ivysaur gets these, these combos in the air at low percent that can just set up into nasty things if you do not DI them correctly. Good awareness by Kip there, knowing that he could jump and up B to grab that ledge. Ivysaur up B is so good at just grabbing the ledge from so far away. But Shade just walking around with this stitch right now. Uh oh. Okay. Could have spelled danger. That stitch. Such a crazy, crazy move. Ah, the float forward air gonna catch Kip. Trying to come out of shield. Gonna take that stock. All right, forward throw from the Charizard. Back air. Uh, fast fell that back air so he didn't get it to come out. Kip barely missing his landing. Getting hasty and up smashing out of shield. That frame six up smash. So good. So strong. Definitely gonna kill Peach right now. The Perry Flare Blitz. What a man. Kip, ladies and gentlemen. Carrying a Nair. And getting a Flare Blitz. But getting edge guarded by these turnips. He's able to make it back because of Charizard, but he's going to air dodge in and get red by Shade. Up smash going to take that game. Wow, what a sequence of events there. These players. Man, they are, this is like a roller coaster. These guys up and down all the time. Tempo of the match always changing. Such a fun set to watch. So it looks like Shade is up here 2-1. Uh, we're going to be going into game four on Kalos. Kalos is the pick. Um, don't exactly know why Kip is opting for Kalos. Maybe... Let's see. Maybe he's switching characters? I'm not entirely sure. Don't know if this is just a good stage for Pokemon Trainer or if... We're going to get a switch. It looks like he's going to stick Pokemon Trainer. Maybe. He's thinking about it. Maybe. We're going to see a Wario switch. Man, Kip. Do you believe in Pokemon Trainer? That is the question. Do you believe that you can do this right now with Pokemon Trainer? Yes, he does. Gonna get right into game four. Some more Peach Pokemon Trainer action coming out here. Kalos definitely uh, a stage where I feel uh, it, it, it's it's FD with some side platforms and walls. Uh, walls definitely help Pokemon Trainer uh, with the Squirtle recovery, uh, and the FD setting uh, is definitely gonna keep the gameplay uh, pretty linear. Uh, gonna be a lot of direct interactions, no no real platform interactions. Um, bar maybe some, some advantage state situations. But it looks like we're going blow for blow here in game four. Ooh, Kip trying to bait that air dodge. Gonna get the razor leaf to up air confirm. Gonna miss the up B. Wow, just catching him with forward smash on that landing. The pullback on Ivysaur forward smash so long. Gonna be able to catch shade. Ooh, good grab on that, that unspaced back air on shield. Up here, not quite going to take it yet. Good DI from Shade. We're off stage again. We're going to see the Ivysaur down air. Good recovery by Shade. Peach Bomber into the ledge to avoid that in between the down airs. Ooh, fair on shield, going to be safe. Kip trying to call out a spot dodge with that forward smash. The landing back here to put him off stage. Ooh, that was a cheeky nair. Wow, gonna get caught DIing in on the forward air, gonna kill Shade right there. Oh, he got grabbed. Ooh, that down throw up there, not not connecting yet. Even with the rage, not quite connecting yet. This is this is the point where Shade begins to put you off stage and ledge trap you relentlessly with his uh, lagless aerial moves. Boom, right there. Just gonna come down on him with Nair. 
after the float cancel. That float cancel is so tricky. Knowing the timing and knowing when that Peach is going to do that, you will have to guess. Okay. We got shield pressure. Taking turns on each other's shields here. Up air juggles. All the withdrawal, the Randy withdrawal, neutrals. Oh! Forward air to up B. Barely missing. Oh. Great landing with that up on shield. Tried to catch Shade coming out of shield with a laggy option. Oh. Yep. Dalian's so good at knowing when Kip wants to cross him up and coming out of shield with the correct aerial to cover the option. Oh my goodness, Shade almost getting that turn up to forward air conversion would have been crazy. Back air, still gonna take it as Kip fishing a little hard with this Charizard, trying to, to get a stock here. Tight game here in game four. Oh, the forward, forward smash narrowly missing. Ooh. Oh, tricky stuff, tricky recovery, gonna get caught. Gonna take some up airs. Oh man, Peach can do so much damage so quickly. This is bad news for Kip right now. Oh, catching the turnip. Shield pressure. Yep, you're gonna catch Dalian in the air. Oh man, this is anybody's game. The damage that Pokemon Trainer can put out is absurd. Especially when you air dodge into him. Oh, job on Shade. Catching that withdrawal. Okay, edge guard situation. We've seen this one before. Oh, goes for that same up smash that he took game three with. Forward air on shield, gonna cross up. Another forward air on shield. He cannot take one more of those. Oh man, it's so scary against Peach. You need to shield, but when she starts hitting you with those those safe moves on shield. Oh, I'm gonna catch Kip coming over the ledge. Forward air gonna take it. Charizard being a huge target. Good stuff to Shade, taking that set 3-1. Incredible gameplay from both, both players.